Welcome to Tenorshare channel. If you just turned to iPhone from Android, I bet you must have lots of data to migrate. Your photos, videos, music, apps, message, and etc. So today, I'll introduce two easy and efficient way to help you transfer your data to from your Android to iPhone. Let's get started. So the most common and easiest way to transfer is by using Move to iOS app. As you can see, here on my Android, I put some pictures and videos, and here is music and contacts. So first let's go to Google Play on your Android and search Move to iOS. And install it. Once installed, open it. So this is the interface. Before we start to move, we need to factory reset the iPhone. Go to settings and reset and tap erase all content and settings. Then enter the passcode and tap erase. Okay, so after factory reset your iPhone, we can start to set it up. Here I just skip the unimportant steps. When it goes to apps and data, we'll see there's an option called move data from Android. Tap it. So as you can see, here goes the important part of today's video. We just tap continue on both phones. And tap agree on terms and conditions on Android. On the iPhone it shows the code to enter on Android. Let's follow it. Then on Android, it'll ask to connect to Wi-Fi network that created by iPhone. We just tap continue and connect. Let's wait for the transfer data screen to appear. Next, select the content that you want to transfer. We can move contacts and message history, photos and videos, and mail accounts and calendars. As for music, we need to transfer manually. Once confirmed, tap next. Even if your Android device says the process is complete, leave both your devices alone until the loading bar on your iPhone completes. This process can take a little while. Wait for the loading bar on your iPhone to finish. Then tap done on your Android. No, we can continue the setup on your iPhone. Once done, data should be transferred. That's very easy. So the second way I'll introduce today is by using an app called ShareIt. What we need to do is to download ShareIt on both of your phones. You can easily find it on Google Play and App Store. Let's check out how it works. Once it's downloaded on both sides, open it on your Android. It would be the sender, so we tap send button. What we can transfer are apps, photos, music, videos, and other files. Let's try to send some photos to your iPhone. And we can see it's now searching for receivers. Let's turn to iPhone. Tap receive button also on the upper left corner. It may take a while for Android to find your iPhone, so just be patient. Okay, iPhone is detected. Tap it. And boom, the photos we selected have been transferred to your iPhone in seconds. It's super fast. Let's check the album on your iPhone. We'll find that the transferred photos have been automatically saved. So this is how ShareIt works. Also, many people use WhatsApp. Neither move to iOS nor ShareIt could help transfer WhatsApp message. There is also a third-party tool that can help you solve this problem. It's called iCareFone for WhatsApp transfer. All you need to do is to connect both your phones to your computer. By following the instruction on the software, just a few steps, you can transfer the WhatsApp message without any problems. Definitely you should try it. You can click the video on upper right corner to learn more about this tool. Okay, so that's all for today's video. If it helps, don't forget to give us a like, and I'll be grateful if you subscribe. See you in next video.